Hey yo YouTube, how's it going? Welcome back to Coromon, we're picking up where we left off. My name is Jay Chubbs, for those who don't know me, but you can just call me Chubbs if you want. In the last episode, we... Did we start our trek into this ice biome? I believe we did. And uh, we had some, we've seen some interesting Coromon. We had some very intense fights, um, and we had to backtrack quite a bit. But we're escalating, we're escalating, ascending, we're climbing the mountain essentially because we are trying to get up to the very top which i guess i could show you on the map if that's not the map get potatoes that's not the map anyway as you can see we're probably trying to get to this little town here whatever this is and then we're probably gonna have to go north to get to the titan um so we're just trying to make it to this checkpoint over here we're in the freesia pass right now and it looks like you can find cup zero here Ooh. Oh, and our stinky set ran out. But you know, if I can find a Cup Zero, we might have to put it on the team. I'm just saying, if I can find a Cup Zero, I might put it on the team. We were talking about starters in the last episode, and I want to see, I really want to see Cup Zero's final form. Because we haven't gotten a chance to see it yet. Body Blast? Volcadon learned Body Blast. The user hurls its body at the opponent with a 20% chance to knock down the target. After that, it only has, like, flash skills. Oh, from the TMs. I totally forgot about this. Fiery Breath versus Firestorm. 100-100. I don't... Did I ever not give that to him? Because we've had Cinder for so long. Anyway. I could get rid of Seismic Wave and give him Body Blast. I think that's fine. That's fine. We'll do that. Yeah, if I can find a Cup Zero, I would 100% take it. Oh, hello. Now, I'm guessing I can only get one of you. I can't probably get both of you. But a Kai Kyra Beast. Not Kyra, goodness. Cry. Like cryo, uh, cryogenics. It's like the, the science of freezing. Similar to thermodynamics, the si uh, energy science. Or no, thermodynamics is like the, the... Is that energy or is that just heat transfer? I don't remember. Come on, don't be frozen. I need you to dethaw here. I know you can take hits all day here. Fully rested, perfect. This may not work, but we're gonna try. Yeah, I would take any Cup Zero, honestly. I would take a neutral Cup Zero. I was just thinking about it too, because it's like, maybe I want to try out an Ice type. Like, we could swap Ice for Electric. Uh, no, we don't need to check it out right now. Um, send a Cormon Storage. We know he was, we had, he had fully rested. He's a big Ice type. We've seen him. We've seen the him and the evolution and everything before, so. I actually did want to take the, um,. The item off of Magnemire real quick though. Oh, gosh, I have to hit summary and then hit take item. Cause he does he just doesn't need the sloth gem right now. You have the gold lump, which is fine. I don't think everybody else has anything. So that should be a-okay. And the smart gem. Yeah, we'll keep the smart gem on. Um so I do want you to keep leveling up. Alright, let's keep moving then. I think we gotta go down. Oh, we do not have to go down here. HP cake large though, that's a bet. Hello. Game? Hello? It's not responding. Oh, we're responding. Alright, well after a little bit of a lag right there, <laughs> we're saving the dang game. I know there's gonna be issues on my end today. I woke up to a Spectrum service outage in my area. Freeze of Pass, tip three. Yellow snow is not edible. Neither is red, green, blue, or purple. Oh, but yeah, I woke up to a little bit of a service outage in my area. Um, Spectrum said they rec recognized this at, like, 9 o'clock today. And they said it wouldn't be fixed until 2 p.m. It is currently 1. So... <laughs> Let's 
Is this... Is this the Cub Zero final form? Is this the Cub Zero final form? Borealis? Like the Aurora Borealis, but it's Borealis, which is kind of clever and I really like it. Hot diggity dog! You splash and forget! Potato! I'm catching it. I'm catching it. It's going on the team. I don't care. Don't. <sighs> Volcanon, you can't do that to me. My heart. Come here. <laughs> Come here right now. Yes, let's go. Yes, I want to look at your summary. He's so cool looking. He has the cocky grin and everything, like the anime. He's like, <laughs> Splash, Snowball, Revenge, Glacier. He's not holding anything in stoke. After taking super effective damage, the Cormon's defense or special defense increases by two stages depending on the type of damage taken. Yeah, we're going to replace a squad member. Magnemire, you've done us a good service, but it's time to send you out. We'll see you later, buddy. And welcome Barry Alice to the team. Ah, oh, it's so sick. Ask and you shall receive, am I right? Now I know that they're here, I want a potent hunt for one. Are you kidding me? Bruh. 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 Oh, we're... Get out of here. Sorry, I'm having some issues on my end. Hopefully that didn't... My computer is being stupid today. Are you going to let me use it, please? Alright, this needs to go away. Goodness. Computer issues today. I might have to, like, in between episodes here, sit down and just, like, address all these things doing things in the background. Things doing things in the background. But yeah, I kind of want a potent hunt for one now. I'm not going to lie. Um, I am going to give you that um, sloth gem because you're going to have to crank out some levels. Um, let me just take a look. I'm just curious. I'm just a little bit of curiosity. There's a Torah bolt! You guys, come on now. Making me catch Biddy Bolt so early on when there's level 50 Torah Bolt all the way up here. Goodness. Oh, now I gotta catch this thing too, because we don't have a Torah Bolt. Oh, that's gonna hurt. That's gonna... Oh, it didn't hurt as fast as I thought. Um, okay, so, level 50... Uh, that went down to 59. Do I have any electric spinners? Yes, static spinner. Goodness. You fuzzy wuzzy. Ouch. Um, okay, try one more time and hopefully don't die. I'll throw a golden spinner. It's a golden spinner, yellow spinner for a yellow boy. Oh, you potato, you ungrateful potato. Oh, well, that's gonna do no damage. <laughs> Alright, now I'm gonna swap. Very Alice, dude. Let's go. It's so cool. And then you find Torval. Like, good. Revenge Jaws? Again, doing no damage, bro. You're doing no damage right now. I'm not going to use a Platinum Spinner. That's a waste. I mean, it should be like Pokeball, Great Ball, Ultra Ball, and then I don't know. My brain is trying to, like, associate in comparison. One. Two. Three. Click. Thank you. Yes, I will check out Torvald's summary because... 125,000 XP? Huh. Revenge Jaws, Multi-Bolt, Mighty Roar, Spark Disc. I mean, to be honest, any of Zealous skills used by the Cormon deal 20% more damage but cost 2 more SP. It's really not that bad. Um, in all honesty, if I didn't just catch the um, Barry Alice, I probably would have just put this Torvald on the team. I probably would have. I probably would have. I'm just trying to see if there's any baby Cub Zeros here. There's a Blizzian. I gotta catch that too now. 
So what does the blizzard actually do? That's my question, because if the, the blizzard increases chances of getting frozen or increases the chances of ice cold, I don't know what that do. Alright, what if I just hit you with Firestorm? That'll probably kill you, but if it doesn't kill you, I'll catch you. Nope, no shot. I'll take the XP, though. We're training up our, uh, our Barry Alice. Uh, let's see here. I kind of want you to... Have that. Goes to level 53. Nice. We'll take that. Now, honestly, I could probably take, um... Borealis in between episodes and go to um, got a purple heart energizer gem times one has been added to your inventory uh, but yeah I could probably go to Darwin or oh like Darwin I got you haha -ha. clever uh, but yeah I was probably gonna say I could probably take Barry Alice because he has splash and things like that could probably take him to a fire zone and train him up there. But he's not that far behind on levels. But anyway, let's keep moving. It's already been 11 minutes, and I don't want to waste everybody's time. And I could just be training on my own. Champ fruit? What's up, bro? Phew. Glad I sprung for the boots when the most traction with the most traction control. I nearly stopped myself from sliding it into an ice hole, but my spinners weren't so lucky. Perhaps the battle will warm them up again. Luma set. All right, that's the thing I saw before. Is it frozen? It's literally frozen. That sucks. Well, hold this firestorm for me. Maybe I can dethaw you. Nope, nothing. Sorry. Oh, it thawed out. Swarm shocker. It's all good. Hold this firestorm for me. That's one down. Malavite. Oh, so you're Gumi, which evolved into Molebash, which now evolves into Malavite. I'm just gonna firestorm you as well. I don't know if Firestorm actually dethaws you or not, but I'm just gonna hit you with it. Molebash evolves into Malavite. Interesting. Well, you did take two of those. Dust Storm? That's a special ground type move. Wow, that did nothing. Alright, what's y'all? Flaming Tackle. Sumo Stance. See ya. Wow, Bulganon's actually, like, standing on his ground for once. Not that he doesn't, but I mean, like, you know, he's not getting walled. Barry Alice, level 43. Sir Pike. Oh, Sir Pike. That's Sir Pike. You know, honestly, I should just be using fire up while they're frozen and then just blasting them. You know what? Will he stay frozen for one more turn? If I use fire up now, then I have to recover SP. I'm just going to recover the SP. If I had thought about this like two turns ahead, then I could have done that, but I didn't. Don't poison chomp me. That's so rude. Now, who's faster, me or the frozen guy? <laughs> well, I mean, we thought him out just like he wanted. Look at that, we just blasted our way up to 55. We're not done yet, I thought the fight was over. Oh, I forgot about you. And since you're frozen, the best course of action is to go out into... Ecliptor! Actually, just like that, Volcadon might now be the highest level monster on the team. You're frozen solid, no big deal. I'm just gonna go right for that Ball of Darkness. I'm not wasting any time here. Nice! Good job, Ecliptor. Heck yeah. Barry Alice, grid level 44. Two milestones achieved. Well, at least they ain't froze no more. 10,000 coins. Gold coins, whatever you want to call it. 
Milestones. We'll claim that. We'll claim that. Any more? Oh, we're so close to 50, though. It'd be so nice to be done with it. <laughs> Not gonna lie. Because then it's like, what do we get? Reduces the SP cost of your skills by one point. You know what? Let me give this to... Now that Volcadon is level 55 and he's caught up, I'm gonna give him the Revitalizer. And then reduces the SP cost of your skills by one point. I might give that to... Mm, do I give that to Ecliptor? I'll give this Chong Toad for now. Nice. And then I'll give the Gold Lump to Ecliptor, because he's at a decent level. Give a Smart Gem to Dugterra, and then give a Smart Gem to Goldbeak. And everybody now has an item. Look at that. And I haven't healed yet. <laughs> All of that work, and I didn't even heal. Detox, my friend. Detox. And then you need to... Wait. Restore all HP and SP. I want to save that. I'm going to save that. Yep, see, we totally got it to full anyway. Yep, let's keep going then. Ooh, we got a frozen lake here, dude. That looks fun. A little bit of ice to slide on. I'm here for it. What's the catch, though? Oh, dear. What is happening? I got frozen solid. Where am I? Wait. This doesn't look like the Titan is anywhere around here. I'm sorry? Like, where are we? Also, why can't I stand in between these? Oh, man, my, uh... would love to be aligned properly. We're in a lobby. Me? Hello? Helda. These flowers will look lovely tonight at tonight's midwinter festival. I can hardly wait until the preparations are done. I was expecting more of like, oh, you're in awake. You're in awake. Oh my word. Um, you're awake. Like, welcome, strange traveler, to a lobby. Hold on, you gotta figure out where you wanna be. You wanna be right... Oh, I can't. I was pointing at the screen. You wanna be right here, because then you can slide up. So that means you gotta go boom, maybe. Hmm. Let me think. How would you do that, though? I think you gotta start up here. No. Mm -mm. So if you came over here, you'd slide down and then left and fall into that little hole. If I go up. No. So now let's just. Oh, those are block. Those are um, blockage thingies. They actually stop your movement. Oh, okay. Now, well, now that I know that, that changes the game. I thought you'd fall through the hole. We just got all the cakes. We got some grass over here. What? What's out this way then? I'm a little confused. Is this where we just fell in? Frost Peak. All right. Well, now I feel like I'm going places I shouldn't go. Interesting. There's a big bearded man over there. I'm so confused. How did I end up here? Also, why is it so cheery all the time? Don't get me wrong, I like it and the music and stuff, but... I'm breaking in! Knock, knock, mother truckers. Lady, did you bring me up here? I'm so excited. The show tonight is sure to be fantastic with singing and dancing and ice skating and... But I should focus, or these outfits won't be ready in time. Can I get 
need an outfit. A big bow. That's not the outfit I was referring to. I ain't wearing no bow. Get out of here. Can't make me. I don't care how many subs I got. I ain't wearing a bow. <laughs> Um, where are we supposed to go then? Is this how- oh, the village continues. We were sent so far. Greta, hey you, you're finally awake. Come, join our cozy fire. This is very, uh, interesting. Hello, um, where exactly am I? Oh, where am I exactly? You're in the remote village known as Alavi. How are you feeling? Ah, uh, I'm not gonna get that accent. You must still be shivering. My husband found you out at the freezing cold water. I hope our abode was toasty enough for you. I fired up the wood stove too real hot. Safely, of course. That was you? It was very warm, thanks. I, well, it's a long story, but I need to find the titan of this land. How do I get back to the mountain? Oh, ho, ho, go right back up again. And what will you do if you fall in another ice hole? Those holes have been appearing all over the mountain, in the mountain, as well as these weird crystals. Nope, I won't let you go until we're sure it's safe up there. Could you join me then? I really need to get there as soon as possible. Yeah, sure, I was planning on patching those ice holes first, but you, you can't expect me to dish on an empty stomach. Today is the midwinter solstice, everybody. Everyone's been preparing all day for the big feast. Feel free to devour some food along with us. There's plenty to go around. Actually, some of the villagers are perfectionists. They could probably use a hand to get everything done in time. The sooner we eat, the sooner Yarl can help you on your way. Why don't you use that enthusiasm of yours to help our townspeople prepare? Of course, what can I do to help? That's a lot of dialogue. We all have our own duties. Best to ask around. I'm sure they'll appreciate the help. Okay, I'll ask around. What if I actually don't want to? I saw the little guy over here, though. Where'd you go? Not you. Yeah, what's up, buddy? How you doing? <laughs> That's it, that's it. That's all you got. Alright. Break it in! Again! What's up, sir? Hello? I'm Gunner. Yes, I am the man known as Gunner Gunnerson. Who might you be? I'm Chubbs. I've come to help with preparations for the festival. Gunner Gunnerson don't need no outside help. Gunner Gunnerson can take care of me own. If Gunner Gunnerson wanted help, he would ask his son, Gunner 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 such 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 such. Well, I'm going to steal your cake, then, since you're a bully, and I'm going to leave. If I needed help, I'd ask my son, Gunner, Gunner, son, son. Smart dude. Real invigorating. Splash Spinner. Splash Spinner. Are we going to be running into, uh... Yeah, we should probably restock on some items. Hello! Yes, I would like to buy some items. Well, at least we're in the twenties of thousands now. Uh, you know... You have a little bit of everything here. I just want to have like two of everything. Because you never know. You just never know. I only have two Phoenix shards left. Yeah, we need a lot more. Okie doke. So ya. Alright, now that we've recovered and restocked our items, I guess we're going to keep looking around and helping townspeople out. Welcome to the Trader of. Hope you find what you're looking for. Welcome to the Curio Shop. Hope you find what you're looking for. It's an old one. We got an axe over here with dip fruit inside of it, apparently. So what's out here, might I ask? Is there anything?
No? Okay. I was just curious. Are there baby cup zeros in the grass? Baby cup zero? -o? I'd believe it. There is a blaze bird. What level are you at? You are, you have winter coat and you're level 38. I am going to hit you with a body blast and probably send you to the next dimension, but all the same. No, but I did. He's like, no. I got you. We've awakened some of our potential. Uh, let's get 100 defense, 100 special defense, and then I'm going to put the rest into SP. Not bad. But now is the time for Volcadon to take a break. Because... What's he holding? Oh, the Revitalizer, right. Yeah, he should take a break. <laughs> he's been busting out levels, and he's level 55, so... He has been cranking and spanking levels. I don't know. Hello! Oofield. Turn back now, friend. This is Velua's most dangerous trail. Um, what if I'm the most dangerous trainer? Do you ever think about that? I don't think so. See, they just don't know who they're dealing with. You know what I'm saying? They just don't know. I bet you there's something... Uh, I was going to say there's something chilling with that snowman, but uh, I think he's just chilling by himself. Yes, P cake extra large. I'll take an extra large cake, please. With extra icing. A frigid scent. Interesting. So, question is, what type of cake is best? Or, if cake is okay, what type of frosting is best? I am a sucker for a good um, cream cheese based icing. Or, well, I should say cream cheese frosting. Either that or a, um, a buttermilk frosting. Very, 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 very good. I thoroughly enjoy both. Haven't had them in a while, though. Alright, so this old lady up here probably needs help. So we should probably help her. Hello, are you in need of assistance to prepare for the festival? Oh, just look at those rags. No, I don't need any help, but the inverse is true. I can help you. Those clothes aren't shit if it's weather. Take this coupon. I got it when I moved here. How many years ago? I take care of my own clothes, so I never have a need for it. But if you can use it to redeem a nice warm coat at the local market. Thanks. Now the showing must continue. The ice skaters need to look fabulous tonight. You know, I've seen like maybe five people. So where are all these ice skaters at, huh? Eh? The same. I am just super saiyan. Is there anybody here? I mean, I probably should have talked to her, but... We got a shield. We got a sword. I took the Viking helmet. Alright, that's just rude. The crystals won't stop. The veil is overrun with them now, and it is me. And is it me, or do they seem bigger, darker, more volatile than before? This isn't good. My duty to protect the town is at all costs. All costs. Still, I can't help but wonder. Where do they come from? Why are they here? And more importantly, why do I have to slay them to get rid of them? Oh, who do I have to slay to get rid of them? Sorry. I mean, I don't see anything else. Might have to explore its size. These flowers look lovely. Can't wait till the preparations are done. Who am I supposed to talk to then to help? There's like a whole... There's like two houses here. We, this is Granny so a, so a lot. And, uh... Unless I was supposed to literally talk to those two at the front. Because that guy doesn't need help either. So, maybe it's people here? Do you need help? Do you need help? Seems like not everyone's ready yet. What? Who needs help? Thor Thorbjorn? Alright. I just want to help, you know? Help the grown-ups and the goodness of my heart. By building the best snowman ever. What do you think? Great! It's beautiful. No, it's not. You You didn't really look, did you? Did you? It can't be perfect when it has no nose. But carrots don't grow here. My mom says I'm way too young to go to other towns. 
You got a perfect stormy a mineral fish is ruined. Or what if I have a carrot already? I don't appreciate this kid. He's rude. He is rude indeed. What you need? Hey, your mind taking taste? What? Yuck! <laughs> Tilly! I, I was really hoping it would taste better for you. You see, this is my first year I'm attempting to reproduce my mother's old family recipe. But I suppose it just won't work when it got exactly the right ingredients. So I picked the best local mushrooms, and here I am trying to use old stock. Shame on me. Which mushrooms do you need exactly? I can get them for you. Really? That'd be so nice. I'm sure the townspeople taste buds would be grateful. I need five sweat shrooms, and then surely the stew. I might actually already have those. <laughs> this smells gross. Yep, I already have one. Snip them up, stir them, and give me. It turned red. This one. It turned red. Mm, yeah, it should taste real good, just like my grand used to make perfect. Hey, you should try it again. That's way too spicy. And for an outsider, perhaps, I'm sure the people will love it here. I just gotta finish this up and then it's ready to serve. Thanks for the assist. I got a chef's hat. <gasps> I wanna wear it. Yo. <laughs> Okay, now that one kid needed a carrot, so let us quickly, since we're almost out of time for this episode, go back to Hayville, because I'm guessing the carrot's in Hayville. It may not be, it might be in Paulbury or something like that, but I'm assuming that it's here in, you know, Farmerville Central. So let me get carrot to defeat the snow. Man. See carrot right here. Can I just take this? Thanks, bro. How many carrots am I allowed to take? What, do, what else do carrots do? Do carrots have like an additional effect? I sincerely hope that I'm not just taking carrots because I can. <laughs> I don't see it. Where is it? Oh, carrot. It's just literally just a carrot. Well, we got three, just in case we need them. Okay. Okay. We'll go back. We'll turn in this carrot thingy. So in town, you can get those, and then... Where's that guy? Where's this dude right here? I don't know. I don't know. What I do know is that we're going to turn in this quest and hopefully not begin the festival yet because I don't want to do that yet in this episode because I will run out of time. Why you got me carrots? You're seriously the best. Wait, you took all my carrots? Bruh. Okay, so apparently not everyone is ready yet, so everything worked out according to plan <laughs> because we're going to call it here for an episode. Thank you guys so very much for watching, and the next one we'll hopefully finish helping the townspeople, and then we will be able to hold the festival and then venture back into the mountains. Um, but with that, though, I'm going to call it here. Have yourselves a great day, and I'll see you in the next one. Later, guys.